Hey guys, this is Raz Grease 2006 coming with a video on how to dye your Nolad lever. They're all white. They're white to make them stronger. There's an adhesive that makes them white. But with a little writ dye and a little time and patience, we can make them whatever color you want. So what you're going to need is you're going to first need a pot that you don't care about. Go to Goodwill or, you know, steal one from your mom. Um, you need a typical 16.9 ounce bottle of water. I have Giant Eagle, but I prefer Nestle. You need some floss, no lad lever, tape, and your desired writ dye, which uh, DP Anja Boy on PB Nation requested these are black. I want to thank him for allowing us to uh, use his levers as a test video. Uh, so what you're going to want to do is you're going to take your water and you're going to put it in your pot. And then... Alright. This is my house. I have ooh, dirty dishes. Sorry. And then you're going to take your writ die. And you're going to do four capfuls. One. Two. Three, four. All right, and then you're going to go over to your stove. I just want to clean that so it doesn't stain. You go over to your stove. Doesn't matter if you have gas or if you have um, electric, they all work. And you're going to let this boil. You're going to kind of want to watch it to make sure that you're not going to, like you don't want it to bubble over and like get all over your stove. So you're going to kind of keep an eye on it. And once you get it boiling, just kind of turn it down until it, you know, is bo you want it to boil, but you don't want it to like bubble over. And then what we're going to do with our floss is, um, make a length of it about so and the reason why we're doing this is you want the lever in the die but you don't want it like flat and like not being dyed on one side so these will just kind of naturally hang down like like this because they're heavier on the bottom And go figure, I, I didn't make this long enough. Whoops. Um, so yeah, whatever your stove is like at, you'll just want to like tie it off. If I'm rambling, I'm sorry. Pretty simple really, but you gotta make a video and explain every step. I don't know, you think we should cut here and like just show them? Like, with it? You can cut it later. Alright, whatever. You can't. You got to buy me more. I'll buy you some more floss, I'm sorry. <laughs> Love you. You think there's going to be people complaining that I'm too mean to you again? You know it's still recording, right? I don't care. Some people might find this actually more... You probably need to tell them how to tie a knot. I'm not going to teach these people. <sighs> Boy.
So you're gonna drop them in the pot from the beginning, uh, not that, until they got boiled. That doesn't really matter. I mean, if you wanted it to be like a certain shade of black, or a certain shade of whatever color you're making, then you'd want to monitor like how long it's in it. Mm -hmm. But if you want it to be black, you just want it to be as black as black as possible, which then it won't matter. Yes, black is the most easier color to dye. Yeah, you could definitely say that. Or white. Too. Well, they come white. You'd actually have a hard time dying in white. Yeah, like hair. You scissors. Yeah. Cut. So, um. Good cut. 